What's up everybody, this is Manufactured Opinion and welcome back to my Dragon's Dogma playthrough slash guide. Today I'm just bringing you a real quick video of one of the locations of the Griffic Armor. My personal opinion, the easiest location to get it at, um, the far earliest location you can get it at. It's at the Great Wall Encampment due northwest of Grand Soren. It's not that hard of a, um, a trek. If you saw my earlier video, I kind of went into it in more depth. A couple Chimera. Uh, a few, uh, one bandit camp with a shitload of female bandits. You can actually find the sexy lingerie in that um, bandit camp if you're looking for schmexy clothes. So you can find some of that there, but the trek is pretty easy. You can also find some of the pieces of this armor in Blue Moon Tower, which is an epic slash god awful journey. And you can also find some of it. Well, you can find some of it in Grand Soren if you progress through the game far enough. Eventually, the armor in Grand Soren will sell it. Um, I've also seen accounts of people finding it at the um, Frontier Caverns, so you can check that out too. That's at the Shadow Fort. If you haven't gotten there yet, do the quest Fortress Besieged. But my thoughts on this armor, it's it's on par, and stats-wise, it's on par with the White Hawk and Swordsman armors. So if you've already gotten those, which are far easier to obtain... Um, well, I guess that, that could that's debatable depending on what un enemies you think are harder to fight. But that's a totally a topic for a totally different video. Um, like I said, the stats are on par with White Hawk and Swordsman armors. I don't like it. It kind of look, makes me look bulkier than I, my character really is. So I said pass. So just save before you buy the armor and see how you like it. So uh, yeah, enjoy your armor guys and I will talk to you later everybody. Bye bye.